Okay, I've seen this beautiful vintage 65 Austin Healey for uh, uh, well, a few years now and I met the owner, I talked to him about it and I learned a few things which is very cool. It's uh, not a four cylinder as I thought, it's a six cylinder actually. And he's had this car 43 years. And these are gorgeous automobiles. I think I've only ever seen like two or three of these in the Montreal area. And uh, we're right here at the Orange Julep restaurant. Look at that, Austin Haley 3000 Mark III. But now all of a sudden there's a major influx of people here. So I like how I gotta have to ask him also about these Looks like he's got added some, it looks like he added turn signals to the turn signals, but I think they're just auxiliary lights for safety probably. Maybe the other ones aren't too good, I'll, I'll, I'm going to ask him. I love the two-tone about this, and when I met him, the owner, I told him also, I took a photo of his beautiful car back in 2007, and uh, I remember it was in 2007 because the photo was in slide format, and so I have the year on the back of the slide. But he says that he wasn't driving it at that time because it was under it was under restoration, you know. And look at the look at the beautiful work here on the uh, the latch for the trunk and the uh, the script here for the uh, 3000 uh, model name. Now he told me, my friend, he had this for many years, and when even when he bought it, the car was British racing green, but the interior was blue. And when he put it around the car, looking underneath, he noticed also that underneath was blue as well. So that was, in fact, this is the original color, and even the uh, the white is part of the motif. It's all original. And he even told me, I didn't know this, but the wire wheels were actually made by Dunlop. I was like, holy shit. I had no idea that Dunlop uh, made wheels, you know? Look at this beautiful interior. Look at that. And he also showed me something else neat about this car is if you zoom in here. Now on the center hub of the steering wheel, is actually the turn signal. It's a lever you just turn to the right or left and voila! Very uh, European, that's for sure. Is there? Gas filler there. I'm sure he must have added these. I'm not sure these are original, these turn signals. I think they might have been clear before. Dennis, a couple of questions. Were these original, originally like this or they were clear? It's all original. All original. And what about the ones in the front? There's the clear turn signals and then there's the orange ones like this. The, the orange ones are turn and the clear are running lights. Ah, that's what I thought. You see, the clear ones are running lights. That's I figured it was a safety thing, kind of, you know. Fantastic. Fantastic. I'm sure your, your, your video is going to get a lot of thumbs up. And when I upload this sometime within a week or two, uh, please send me an email if you ever think of me. You have my card. I'd like, I'll send you the link. It's my pleasure. I mean, I'm all about immortalizing these cars. I can't drive them legally, but it's never stopped my, my love affair, you know? Matter of fact, if you saw my apartment, it's like a museum. And we're just going to finish here with a... Uh, oh, uh, Dennis, one more thing. <laughs> How could I forget? Can we, can we see that six cylinder, please? Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Because, uh, frankly, I'm not sure I've ever seen a six-cylinder out of an Austin Haley. I once rode in a 73 Triumph TR6 with a six-cylinder and three carbs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a little bit bigger. Is it? Yeah, that's nice. Now, um, let me take a guess. The carbs are Weber or they're... Uh, what? SU. SU, that's what it is. Thank you very much. Austin? Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, I overhauled the engine. I overhauled everything on this. The carbs, everything. Did you paint the fan yellow or...? Uh... That's the original color. Is that all right? Original. That's and amazing. All original. All original. And I guess, I guess the, the shroud was also, uh, was also originally red like that too, right? The only thing not original is I put a small motor for the, mm -hmm. for the windshield washer. Oh, 
because it had a just a button with a like a, a diaphragm, like a water pistol, you know. And it was uh, it was broken inside. And the new one cost like eighty bucks. Oh yeah. No good. So I put a 